Good afternoon, guys. It is Tuesday, actually, and I wanted to just film a couple days in my life. I haven't done this in a while. I also want to post like a weekend vlog and a week vlog, so I don't know where this will fall, but I just want to give you an update on kind of what I'm doing. I feel like I have been struggling with the book content videos. Not that I've really missed a day. I just feel like I don't know what to film. <laughs> and I think partially it's because I have been working. So I don't know. And then I think of video ideas like reading so and so for a week, but then, you know, now it's Tuesday. So really it's not a week. Um, but I just wanted to film a few days. I'll probably film today, tomorrow, and Thursday, my work week, and kind of chat with you, take you along for the ride. I did work today. That is why I didn't see you at all. Came home not too long ago. I would say a little under two hours ago. I had some soup for dinner, and I've just been reading. I'm currently uploading a video for tomorrow. Currently reading Into the Dark, Magnolia Parks. Um... I am on chapter 20, page 181. I started this yesterday and I'm thoroughly enjoying it. This whole entire series I have adored and I can't wait for the next Daisy Hates book. I, I just, oh, I can't wait. I've adored the series more than I thought I would if I'm being honest. And yeah, so that's a little update on this one. No spoilers, but I am enjoying it. A few things are happening. Um, Obviously, I'm still pretty early into the book, so who knows what's going to happen. Um, what else? I got back from my trip last week, so I feel like that's kind of thrown me off a little bit. I've been really tired. You know, did my February wrap-up and my March TBR picks, so go check those videos out too. I'll be posting all of these in the iCard if you want to go look at them. I just hit 400 subscribers today, which... I can't believe like 400. I know that's not like a lot, but that's a lot, you know, like more than I would have thought in the short amount of time that I've really put effort into this channel. Um, I was posting videos a while back, but they were more like cleaning and just like random videos, my clinical videos. And since then, I've really kind of curved it and developed it into what I want it to be. So that's really exciting. I really want to hit a thousand subscribers by the end of the year. We'll see. My book, Instagram, like really is not growing at all. No matter how much I post, no matter what I do, I just feel like it's not growing. So that's a little annoying, but at least my YouTube, I'm meeting a ton of you guys, especially the people that comment regularly on all my videos that like them. I appreciate that because I do see you. Um, yeah. Anyway, so that's my little update for kind of what I've been up to. Like I said, I work tomorrow. Tomorrow's my late day. So I'll probably read later in the day. And then Thursday I work. I don't know if I'm going to work half day or full day because it just depends on how busy we are if they'll let me. So yeah. I think I'm just gonna read for a little bit longer. I don't really have any other plans for tonight, which makes it easy. Let me, I feel like this chair always squeaks, so I'm sorry if you hear it. I don't know why that is. I just need to not move. Um, yeah, I'm just going to switch laundry really quick and keep reading. We'll see if I can finish this by Thursday. It's a possibility. It is only 5.50 right now. So I still got a little bit of day left. And then I also want to start really grinding out the videos. Really dedicate myself. I feel like a lot of the books I've been reading are thick books. So it's harder to finish in a day and two days. Um, even though I'm finishing them in like three days. But anyway, I'll talk to you um, probably later tonight.
things are going well, I just can expect things to not go well. You know what I mean? Like, it just, it's like uphill, and then it's like a steep downhill. Always. that I started the video in but I am now on chapter 27 so I've read seven chapters and I'm gonna go shower I feel a little gross and then probably get into some comfy clothes read a little bit more I'm probably gonna make my little sleepy girl drink I'm not kidding yesterday I probably could have went to bed at like 8 30 that's how tired I was so I might go to bed earlier tonight just because tomorrow's gonna be long, but I really want to like read this book and get it somewhat finished at least. Just because I have to, I have to film other videos. Literally on like the third chapter I was crying. Um, yeah, <laughs> I've cried a few times. And I'm also annotating. I've been annotating all of these books actually annotating in the sense of like really just underlining and then also sometimes I will write in some stuff but I'm using gray so it's kind of hard to see the writing um so that's kind of what I'm gonna do right now I'm gonna go shower I will probably see you afterwards all right it is eight o'clock and it's time to make my sleepy time drink is what I'm calling it um, basically it just helps you sleep. It's not alcoholic or anything, <laughs> but first off, have this cup. This is just from Meyer. I think it's supposed to be like a wine cup. Brian got it for me and I haven't used it yet, but I'm going to use it today. So have my cup, the sparkling drink I use. I used to use sparkling water. I still have it in my fridge. Like it's fine, but I recently tried it with lemon lime Olipop and I really like it because it adds a little bit more flavor. So I'm going to crack this open, put this in my cup, and I'm going to fill this about halfway. Then I am taking just tart cherry, 100% tart cherry juice. I got mine from Meyer. It's not refrigerated um, like when you buy it on the shelf, and I found it over by like the juices and everything. That's where I got it. I'm sure Walmart has it, but I'm not sure. I just know I, I've gotten it at Meyer. So pouring this in here, about two thirds of the way. So half of the sparkling water, half of that for this. Um, other people do add magnesium. I just don't have it, so I don't add it. I don't know if it's placebo or what it is, but for some reason, I always get tired when I drink this, so I think it works. What I'm going to do, grab a straw really quick, and I'm going to stir this. I didn't put ice just because both of the drinks I just added were cold, <laughs> so I figured I wouldn't add ice because um, I'm hoping to finish it anyway. It's so good. So let me show you how full it is. So this is what it's looking like. I added half of the sparkling drink and then the rest of the tart cherry juice. It's super yummy in my opinion. I think it's delicious. <laughs> so I am just going to drink this, read upstairs for a little bit because my mom just got home and then go to bed. So I will either see you right before I go to bed for an update on my book or in the morning before I leave for work. Hey guys, <laughs> I'm so tired. 8.55, I am going to wait until nine o'clock, take my medicine I need to take, and then I'm going to bed. 
I'm so tired. I am gonna try to read a little bit more and stay off my phone. I've had a little bit of a hard time not going on my phone. Like I just kinda wanna pick it up and take a break. Tomorrow is Wednesday. I have a video going up. It's just kind of like a bonus video because it's not book related. It's my travel vlog and expo day for my Run Disney. Um, I'm going to try to just make them as bonus videos, but if for some reason, like one week, like this Friday, if I really cannot like edit for some reason or have this video done for any reason, then um, I will use those as my scheduled content but for right now they're just bonus bonus videos that if you guys are interested in you can see um i'm still posting mondays and fridays those will hopefully just stay as my book content i know um my packing video went up on a friday but i didn't really have time to read and film a different video so um yeah so mondays and fridays will stay the same um hopefully as book content and then wednesdays i'm gonna like scatter i have this one going up tomorrow i have my 5k still my 10k and my half marathon so that's still three more videos that i can post as bonus videos i try to do some scheduling for video ideas too because i feel like if i have them written down and planned it's a lot easier for me to film edit and upload this might shock some of you guys but a lot of the videos i film i actually film edit and export in the same day i'll film it i'll edit it export it and usually it's um scheduled to upload by that night but that's only some videos some videos takes a little bit longer i was ahead for a while i had like two weeks so like four videos already pre-scheduled um i think it was the end of a month which always helps because you have your wrap up you have your tbr for next month that was nice because then I could just film and not have to worry about s filming, but because then I could just film and not worry about um, needing to finish and edit it. But yeah, that's my update for tonight. I will see you in the morning, probably before I leave for work, if all goes well, and then I will see you after work. Good morning, guys. It is the next day. And I am just cleaning up the room before I'm going to make my lunch and go to work. Um, I did get up a little bit earlier today um, because I had to go to the bathroom so bad. I had to go to the bathroom an hour before my alarm even went off and oh, it was just awful. So I'm up a little bit earlier than I normally am. So that gives me a little bit more time. Um, I work until about six and I'm not sure what I'm going to pack for lunch yet. I think I'm just going to pack some fruit, meat and cheese, maybe my, um, calzone because I need to eat it before it goes bad. I'm just cleaning up the room right now and I will talk to you right before I leave. Um, or when I'm making my lunch. I'm not sure which one yet. This is what the lunch is looking like. I have fruit. I'm also bringing some for my co-worker, so that's why there's kind of a lot. Um, this is just rotisserie chicken style deli meat, and I just put the string cheese. I was going to put a few slices of cheese, but I haven't had one of the string cheeses yet, so I figured I'd do that. This is just in case, like, I do not feel well in the morning. Sometimes when I'm not eating and I wake up early, I feel a little nauseous. So, blueberry muffin granola bar. And this is all I think I'm going to bring. But I have um, one of these Alani New protein bars in my bag already. So, I don't think I'm going to pack, like, another one. I took one bite out of it yesterday just to see if I liked it. Um, yeah, so I'm going to change my shoes and then we are going to head to work. Let's head to work. 
for hopefully a fast and not too complicated day. I just made it to work. I don't know how much I'm going to be able to film just because for confidentiality reasons and HIPAA, um, I probably won't be able to show much. I will try to on my lunch. Probably just like a clip of me eating and reading is probably what you're going to get. Um, and then I will talk to you when I get out of work. If you didn't know, I am a physical therapist assistant, a PTA, and in July, this will be my one year working, which is crazy because last May, I graduated. So in May is my one year being graduated um, from college, which is crazy. So yes, if you are curious of what I do, that's what I do. That's why I don't really have any off time when I'm at work. Uh, if I have hours where patients no show or end up canceling, I can't really like sit down and read and I can't really like leave, uh, obviously. So yeah, that's, that's what I do. And I am part-time with benefits. So I have enough hours to get benefits, but I'm still only working three days a week, which is quite nice because that means Friday through Monday, I'm able to film and do other things um soccer games everything like that so yeah that's a little update if you have any questions about my job or if you were curious about going into it please let me know because i enjoy talking about it especially while it's all fresh on my mind with the classes and how it felt um during the semesters but i'm at work so let's go inside hopefully it's fast Hello guys, I hope you can hear me okay. I turned off like my heat, that way it's not so loud, but it is currently six o'clock and I am on my way home. Today was very slow. It wasn't very difficult, it was just like long and boring. Um, yeah, I'm on my way home right now. I'm gonna get home, change, uh, see if the laundry needs to be switched. And then I actually have to do a lot of things tonight. I have to make dinner for Brian and I because he's at practice so he can eat when he gets home from practice. And then what else? I need to vacuum the floor because this weekend or maybe even tomorrow, I want to like spot clean our carpet. So maybe I'll do that tomorrow or tonight it just depends I read a little bit of my book but I think I've only read like two chapters today because my co-worker sat with me at lunch so I didn't really get a lot of reading done which is fine but it just means I kind of want to do more later I did just post my travel and expo day go check it out I know it's not book related but it's still very fun and I couldn't read and that's why because I was on my trip <laughs> I'm about to get home, so I will talk to you while I'm making dinner. All right, we are going to make a mishmash of things. First thing I'm gonna make are these meatballs, just so we can eat tonight, tomorrow. I'll bring some to lunch tomorrow. Probably Brian will have some either tonight or tomorrow for dinner. So I'm gonna make these that I got from Target. They're the Swedish style meatballs. We've never had these, but I figured these are really good just as a filler item because I'm also going to make this shrimp that we got at Aldi. They are four skewers and they are shrimp with salted butter and garlic. They're going to look like this. They're frozen, so I'm going to thaw them out. This one is chipotle sea salt, so this one will be for him. So I'm going to thaw both of these before I cook them veg i have some of this we didn't get any fresh vegetables this week because i knew i had some frozen still so frozen this week we'll get fresh next week so just some peas i also need to make this calzone because it goes bad so i need to make this tonight i'll probably eat half tonight save half for brian but that is what i'm going to put together really quick and then we will move on to some cleaning probably. I have these submerging in some room temperature water. I'm gonna do this for like 15 to 20 minutes, I think. I 
was just thinking, I might add this to pasta tomorrow too. That kind of sounds good. Carrot, carrots, what? Peas are done. Meatballs are in the oven currently. I put them for 15, we'll see what it looks like. The shrimp is still thawing. It still has five to 10 more minutes. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go downstairs and vacuum really quick while everything's cooking. And then we'll see kind of what it looks like because by the time those are done, these will be getting ready to go in the oven. second pass lifted some things went in the laundry room look at how disgusting this is gross and i shower or i shower i do shower every week i vacuum every week so that's disgusting not it but i'm glad it's clean now <laughs> and then put the remaining sauce. So I'm gonna save this one and save that one for afterwards. This smells incredible. Also, highly recommend the Swedish meatballs from Target. They are so good. Very easy to make. I kind of wish it had a sauce though, but they're super yummy. Good. I think I'm gonna just take them off the skewer. I was going to leave them on the skewer, but I feel like that's gonna be too much so I'm going to take them off the skewer This is the chipotle and this is the garlic does that not look so good okay i'm gonna clean this all up and i'll see you in a few minutes i tried the shrimp the garlic one was okay it kind of like had like not enough oomph and i don't know maybe if i would have grilled them they would have been a lot better and then the chipotle, I don't love chipotle, but I wanted to at least taste it. The flavor is really good on that one. It is a bit spicy, obviously, but it's still really good. I'm going to let those cool off before I put them in the fridge. I don't really want to spot clean right now. My battery's dying. <laughs> I do not want to spot clean the floor right now. So it's seven. That only took me like an hour to do. So not bad at all for meatballs, two things of shrimp and peas. Oh, and the calzone. I did heat that up. Um, I just didn't show it because there's not much to show. <laughs> I think I am going to get some of the footage off my computer so I have more space so I can upload some of the footage I have in here to that and see kind of what I have for this video so far. I know it's only been like two days, but I'm going to do that and then I'm going to read my battery is dead. I need to change it. Hold on. All right. I'm back just to say I'm going to do that on the computer and then I'm probably going to read for a little bit and see where that takes me because I don't really need to do laundry. I've already vacuumed, obviously. So it's just spot cleaning and reading. 
Good morning. It is Thursday, and another day means another day making the bed. I am moving a lot slower today because... I don't know if I'm supposed to go in this early. I don't have any patient until 11 o'clock. And so, but I'm scheduled 8 to 4. So I was going to get there at like my normal time and just like find things to do. Clean, fold towels, put like pillowcases everywhere they need to go. Um, look at temperature some machines. But I'm not sure... If they wanted me to do that because she didn't say anything so i assume she's okay with me just coming in at my normal time but i'm gonna take my time and make it a little bit longer i'm not gonna leave quite when i normally do um because i do it. there's no reason to so yeah moving slower still need to pack my lunch completely change like put my shoes on and stuff so i will see you right before i leave or when I'm doing my lunch. Okay, this is what the lunch looks like. I have some fruit right here. I have some peas, the meatballs, and I only had like two slices of turkey bacon left and I don't want it to go bad. So I figured I'd burn that granola bar just in case. And I think that's gonna be it. I have my tea, that's why I'm not gonna put anything else in here. So let's finish getting ready and then We'll leave for, sh for school. We'll leave for work. Alright, it is probably like 10 minutes later than I normally leave. But I'm going to leave now. Just because I don't have anything else to do. I'm wearing this sweater from um, Altered State. And then these like straight pants almost i think they're a little skinny but they are from old navy and i'm gonna grab a clip just because i feel like my hair looks a little frizzy this morning so i'm just gonna put it up for the time being and then i'll put it down once i get there Okay, let's go to work. Last day of work this week, and then the weekend. Hi guys, it is around 4.10 I think and I'm on my way home. Today was a lot busier than yesterday towards like the second half. I had a lot of patients and after like 10 o'clock my first three hours were no one. I didn't have anyone. This light is awful so it turns green for probably like... 10 seconds and then it turns red for probably like three minutes anyway <laughs> i am on my way home this is the last day i'm gonna film and honestly i'm just gonna give you like a little update on my book because that's all i'm gonna do today i'm gonna spot clean the floor but that's it i'm taking the night off i'm gonna relax i need to edit and upload export all the things so I hope you guys had an amazing week. I have a little update on the book. I am liking it. I don't know why it feels like it's taking me forever to get through, but I almost wonder if it's because it's so big. I just feel like I'm not making a dent on it. I am enjoying it. I am. There's a lot that's happening. I can almost feel like... Why are they honking? Um, I almost feel like some of it is repetitive like something happens and then it's fine and then the same thing happens and then it's fine and then you know that kind of thing i'm i'm not falling head over heels for it like i thought i would initially like the first few chapters don't get me wrong i was crying it was good 
it's just that we're kind of at a standstill where like some things are happening other things are just not happening um, I really don't know where it's going I'm not even halfway yet and I feel like a part of that is just like I've, I'm working this week I started it during like late weekend so going into it I wasn't gonna be able to read as much as I would have hoped because I'm working I digress um, I'm enjoying it I'm excited to see where it goes I'm just not full force in love with it like I was the first few books it could be like right book wrong time kind of thing um, because yeah I've loved the series so far uh, some characters are kind of irritating me <laughs> in this one and I think it's because I've grown to love them that it's almost like get your crap together what the heck are you doing kind of thing so anyway I just wanted to end the video here I really enjoyed kind of doing this because my work weeks I really don't get a lot of reading done and sometimes it's frustrating but what can you do you know I have to work so I hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a like um, comment some of your thoughts if you've read this book um, if you want to read it any video ideas you might have thank you for sticking to the end I feel like my vlogs are so long for no reason like three three days is like an hour long I don't get it but <laughs> thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next one bye